Just a quick note here, mostly to say that I'm recording readings of these blog posts, so if you don't like to read so much, you're in luck. I've only got the first two done so far, and they are on my YouTube channel. There will be links added at the beginnings of the posts that read, listen to audio, and they will take you straight to the video. Also, I mentioned that Demon can be funny. He really can. Don't get me wrong. I think that even this quality, in a demon, is completely diabolical. The purpose is to foster a false sense of security at least, and to make the victim feel like it's not so bad having a demon around, at most. I think he's hoping I'll give up on exercising him straight to hell. He can keep dreaming. Still, because it might be interesting for anyone who's never met a demon before, I'll share some recent examples. On Friday, Demon was all lovey devey. Yes, he is still that way sometimes. As soon as I woke up on Saturday morning, he said something that I have to admit cracked me up. This demonic entity does not love you anymore, Catholic. No, cuz Satan sprayed this demon with insecticides for spraying you all that stuff about love you so fucking much. Yes, Satan will spray you, with insecticides. Then, he was playing, fiction, by orgy in my head. Now, this is a song that I like, and one that has made my playlist often recently. When I say that he was playing it in my head, well, it's pretty much the exact same thing as when you just have a song stuck in your head. I wouldn't have known the difference on that particular intrusive thought, except for the fact that he commented. Yes, this demon likes that song too. The lyrics go. She dreams in digital, because it's better than nothing. Well, one of the times, as the song was playing in my head, I heard demon singing. She's got a blog post ministry, because it's better than nothing. And yes, I died laughing. How could I not? Later, I was actually listening to Pantera's cover of Black Sabbath's paranoid and i thought to myself this is the only good thing pantera ever did demon chimed in saying that right there is not that damn far wrong that band right there does suck so yeah he's funny but then he reverts to something evil like telling me to kill my cats i roll my eyes at that and spray myself with holy water, which does usually shut him up for a little while, or at least makes him sound weak and far away. He can't influence me anymore. I'm fairly certain that his goal in saying these evil things is to make me worry that he possibly could influence me. I know that he can't, however. My experience has been that he never could, at any time, even when he had me seeing ghosts everywhere influence me to do anything that I didn't kind of want to do anyway and even if he could make me want to do something, he has very limited ability to move my body. He can cause an arm or a leg to jerk, similar to a muscle spasm, but that's all. He did have me thinking some crazy stuff for a while, though, sure enough. Still, I don't believe that I would ever have harmed anyone or anything. Maybe he influenced me to seek more contact with the friendly spirit, sure. I don't think he could have made me do something that I was completely opposed to, however. I'm not saying that's everyone's experience, but it has been mine. To me, anyway, the fact that a demon would enjoy and comment on popular music is a little bit amazing. Granted, this is not information that I ever wanted to learn, but it's amazing simply because I wouldn't have imagined that beings who are millennia old, quite possibly nearly as old as time itself, would be. Well, relatable, I would never, not in my wildest dreams, have thought they'd like our music and movies, or crack jokes, jokes that are actually pretty darn funny. Movies too, yes. The other day, he kept saying, Martha Fokker, this, and, Martha Fokker, that. When I looked confused, he said, Yes, this demon has seen Meet the Fockers. He watched it in your mind. Sometimes, I can't stop thinking about the difficult to believe fact that demons used to be angels. It makes me wonder if angels listen to our music and watch our movies. I wonder which ones they like. She's guilty by
Total. Total. Total.